Hey, what's going on YouTube? Um, hey guys. You guys have been waiting on this video, and sorry if the camera's shaky. You have to hold it so far out, it's acting up. I don't know what, what's going on with it, but um, wanted to take a moment and discuss uh, everything that's been said and done on Twitter over the last couple of days. Um, so, we found out down through the grapevine that Steve Billings was accused and dockets and his mugshot was released that he strangled his wife whatever he did he did some stuff to his wife um a lot of the charges were dismissed the felony charge was dismissed i think he was only uh found guilty of a misdemeanor i think it was but he was still charged with something so we shared his docket we shared his mugshot and then I had said to Mrs. Chubbs yesterday, let's take our baby out on the front porch. It's the day before. Or the day before yesterday. Let's take our baby out on the front porch and let her draw with the sidewalk chalk because she hasn't got to do it that much. So we're out there and I'm sitting on the floor with her. Um, I was trying to spend as much time as I could with her because with me working all the time, I hardly ever see them. Um, I mean, ever see them. I usually work six, sometimes seven days out of... I, I usually work the whole entire week. Um, now while me and me and the baby were sitting on the on the porch, <laughs> while we were sitting on the porch, uh, I had wrote out with a piece of chalk, Steve Beater Billings. Reagan had just so happened to be bending down, and she was going like this, writing on the porch. She's 16 months old. She can't spell. She can't read. Um, we'll when have, she's, I will actually post. The yeah, you'll at the you'll end. see the picture at the end. Of this video, um, but whenever she's got her books, she'll open her books and she'll go blah, 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 like she's reading, but she's not. She can't read. She don't know what letters are. She's sixteen months. She's old. She's sixteen months old. She's a young toddler, very young toddler. People got so offended that they thought that we taught her how to do that. That we are bad parents. We're pos parents. Um, we're teaching bullying, young. We're, yeah, we're, we're teaching bullying to our child. And, uh, you know, it, it's gotten to the point to where people, come on, quit, bud. It was getting to the point to where people are starting to threaten us on Twitter. Um, what he didn't say, let me cut you off real quick, is that we had had prior problems with Steve Billings. Yeah, it wasn't we, just like we just wanted to start stuff. You know, we had, if you're new to our channel um, and you don't know, we had had problems with Steve Billings before. He... Uh, long, long story short, we made a video about fame riders of YouTube, people that will follow YouTubers, that will stick up for YouTubers, just uh, in hopes of getting famous on YouTube by having a bunch of subscribers and views on their channel. It wasn't about Steve, it was just in general. Steve and his girlfriend at the time, I don't know if they're still together, uh, I'm not even going to say her name because it's pointless to do so, it's just going to cause more riff. But anyways, they assumed that the video was about him. All kinds of hell broke loose. And we thought we were cool with Steve. We didn't have no drama with him. Yeah. We were actually... Um, we thought we were actually decent friends with him. We, it, I don't even know. Long story what. short with that, turned out we were not. Uh, we have like maybe a handful of people that we talk to religiously off of YouTube that know us, that know our names. They know roundabout where we're from. But, um, so fast forward, I got into it with a YouTuber by the name of Rick Ramsell, and, um, people were like, you, he said what he said, he was basically dogging us and making fun of us, so before I could really reply to him, he blocked me on Twitter, so I took a screenshot of his Twitter page where it says that, you know, you can't view this because you've been blocked, and I put that he was a... I put that he was a P word. I'm not going to really say it because uh, my daughter's right here. But I had put on there that he was the P ah. word. Laugh out loud. And everybody came unglued and started threatening us saying that he's basically in the mob. Uh, if he's being quiet, there's a reason behind it. Uh, you guys should have known better because now he's going to come after you. And uh, we, have, we, we have screenshots of everything. So, by all means, if he wants to go about it that way, or you guys feel as though he wants to go about it that way, 
I guess if he's a part of the mob, he knows he knows how to find us. So he's more than welcome to just knock on our door or whatever he wants to do. Um, I'm not going to be threatened. It has been constant hell for the last two days. It has been absolutely... I'm getting mad just thinking about it. Um, it's been it's horrible. Been, it's been horrible. Like, to it, the point to where she sleeps in the bedroom with our daughter and I sleep out on the couch because physically I just don't even want to be around her because we're constantly battling because I... Today I got a day off. And I, she's sitting there on her phone... Oh, look what this one's saying. Look what that... I don't care. I'm so irritated about it. And it's non-stop. You're making our life a living hell because we just shared something that everybody has seen on Twitter about Steve Billings. And I'm sorry, but if you're a Steve Billings fan and you still support him after that, don't come to our channel. You're not welcomed here. It's disgusting. I don't understand how you can be okay... With a man that did something to his wife. I don't care if he just went like this and just shoved her. You don't do that. It's disgusting. You're you're nothing if you if you think you can do that to a woman. Um But it's just been you can't see me because I'm just I'm just talking at this point. I don't care. Here you can look at Miss Chubbs. Yeah, I don't want to look at me. Okay. My, my four chins and everything. Yeah, that's another thing. Let me just sweat we'll just switch back and forth for a second here. People were also saying that Mrs. Chubbs is fat. I have ham sandwiches in my fat rolls. Yeah, uh, that I'm fat, that I look like I Bert, which, I mean, I guess I do. I mean, I'm sure the next thing you're you're probably going to say is that I have a big gap between my teeth, or that my teeth are yellow, or that I'm fat, or I'm a horrible father. That's already been done. That we blow smoke in Reagan's face. That, yeah, that we blow smoke in, in Reagan's face. Yeah, we would take and it here's the thing about me being a bad father. Um, in the last four weeks, almost four weeks that I've been at this new job, you have seen me how many how many hours out of that whole three weeks? Not very much. I mean, Maybe hardly. 13 hours, if that. Maybe. Because I'm constantly working. So that I could stay home. So she can stay at home and do what she's doing now. And I'm sure you trolls are already thinking it. So she can sit on her fat ass. That's right. And eat. And eat. My ham sandwiches. Her, sam <laughs> her ham sandwiches out of her whatever. Out of her rolls. You guys are disgusting. You know, for you guys to sit there and say that we're bad people and we're POS parents. Our house may be small. I may drive a 2009 Chrysler Town & Country. We may drive a two uh, a 2000... And one. and one Toyota Camry. Uh, we may have a very small house, but guess what? We accomplished that on our own with nobody else's help. Stop. We don't live at home with our mom. We don't live at home with our mom. We don't live at home, or we don't live with friends. We don't live with family. We're not mooching off the government. Everything that we have is ours that we have bought. Yeah. Like, I'm not trying to boast. I'm really not, but, like, we have a lot of nice things. We have a... 52 inch TV or a 50 inch TV in our living room. We have a 55 inch TV in our bedroom. We have a 21 inch little tiny TV. My dad downstairs has like a 46 inch TV. Um, we have everything that we want or need, but yet we are POS parents. And Reagan is full of toys. The whole living room is full of toys. Her bedroom's so full of clothes she can't even sleep in it. She has to sleep in our bedroom because there's so many clothes and toys in her bedroom. So. I mean, and here's what I have to say. We weren't starting with anybody except the Steve Billings. And, and we weren't even starting with Steve Billings. We weren't we starting. Were just sharing. We were sharing what we thought everybody would want to see. Because not, whether everybody wants to believe it or not, Steve Billings is not liked by everybody on Twitter. No. He, it's a love-hate relationship with Steve. And most 50 of the people that follow us don't like Steve Billings. 50% like him, 50% don't like him. It is what it is. Us, personally, we don't like him. He made our life a living hell when we were not getting along, and he was sending people, or he may not have been sending people. He may have just had his fans come to us and threaten us, like what is going on right now with the whole Rick Ramsell deal. Um, I want to say that they started with us. They started saying horrible things to us. You'll see in the screenshots at the end. Mm -hmm. And we were defending ourselves. Because we were defending ourselves, now... They're going to come after us. And, and here's another thing, too. Um, people are, which I don't care, 
People are saying online that uh, our videos suck. The quality of our videos suck. Our editing sucks. Our this sucks. That sucks. Our channel's know. horrible. Our channel's horrible. But here's the thing. Yeah, we only have like 32,000 views or 33,000 views and like 372 subscribers. I'm not really sure. We don't really care. Right. We did all of this for our daughter and over time it's turned into drama and nothing but bullshit. The whole way through. That's why... Like, we don't care what our style of videos look like to anybody. Like, you either want to watch us or you don't want to. We're plain Jane YouTubers. We're not going to go out and spend, nor do we have the money to go out and spend seven, eight hundred dollars for a camera and a couple hundred dollars for lighting. I mean, we're using a lampshade tilted on its side and I put in a light bulb and, a, and our ceiling light to make it brighter in here for this video. We're not going to pay all kinds of money to make this big, extravagant YouTube channel. It's real life. What you see is what you get. I would like to address something. Um, so, it also, uh, Steve Billings and wh whatever that dude's name is, uh, was saying that the only way we get views is when we make videos about them. That our videos don't get any views unless we're making videos about Steve Billings. Uh, let me stop you there. With that being said... Go through our channel and find any title that says anything about Steve Billings. Right. Not to mention that I want you to come back in a couple of days and see how many views this video has compared to all of our other videos. Because I guarantee it's going to have the same amount. We, we don't make videos... For the views. Right. We just make videos to have a YouTube channel. Sometimes, depending on the person we may talk about, we might get a couple hundred. Uh, it's rare. I mean, we have one video where we got like 2,000 views. But most of the time, our videos are at like between 45 and 65 to 70. That's it. And, and it doesn't matter who we talk about. We could talk about the most popular YouTuber. Uh, we could talk about um, uh, Roman Atwood, Kid Behind the Camera. It doesn't matter. We're still only going to get like 50-something views. We don't make our videos like, ooh, ooh. What can we do? How can we get more? Let's make a video about Steve Billings so that we get all kind of views. Mm -hmm. No. Yeah. We don't do yeah. things on purpose. Like, we don't pick at people to try to get views. We are just doing a mm -hmm. YouTube channel to have fun. But, and here, here's another thing. Um, and I want to address this real quick. And then we're going to close off on this video because it's getting to be 12 minutes of just rambling bullshit. We absolutely, without a shadow of a doubt, sorry, keep cutting off Mrs. Chubb's That's okay. fat. That's all right. My fat is all over the place. But anyways, we uh, we absolutely, for a long time, hated, hated with a passion, Charlie Chill. Absolutely. Charlie Green, a.k.a. Kid Behind the Camera's brother. I wanted nothing more than to walk up to him and knock his front teeth out of his mouth and break his jaw, to be quite honest. Over this last year, he has showed improvement. Will I say that he's 100% better and everything's okay? No, because nobody knows that. But from what I can see, what I see now, he seems like he's doing better for himself. But if somebody would have found a docket of Charlie Chill beating his girlfriend or his wife, oh my everybody gosh. would be talking about it. He'd be the worst person alive. But because it was... Uh, Steve Billings, now we're back to being one of the most hated families on YouTube. Wait, because wait. They found out Erica got a speeding ticket yesterday. Oh. Uh, and yeah. that's it. I mean, she must be the worst person in the whole entire world right now because she got a speeding ticket. But anyways, where I'm getting at with this and then I'm done is it's either who you know or who you blow on YouTube whether or not you're not messed with. Charlie's going to get... Havoc for the rest of his life, probably, and Steve Billings is going to just skate away. He even made a comment, which I'm sure you guys seen it on Twitter, where he basically said that, well, in Minnesota, it's just a misdemeanor. Ha ha ha, laughing emojis, whatever. It just shows, I don't know, I'm just over it. But we wanted to get on here and just say, for the record, after this video, we're not discussing anything about drama anymore. We don't care, we're going to keep it to ourselves. I've had to block so many people, and most of the people, which kills me, I'm going to address this one real fast, where they said, oh, that guy just has no balls. His wife's in charge. Now, let's be honest. Who's in charge in this family? 
You. Me. And no, I, I, that that was probably wrong because now they're going to be like, oh, he probably beats her. He's probably mean to her. I'm just the one who's in front of the line that makes sure everything is said or done. Why did you just lick the back of my head, goofball? And we started blocking people that night because we realized that they were young kids and we're not going to argue with young kids. You know, I mean, it's just okay, not on. us. We're not going to do it. So as soon as we realized it was a young kid that was saying horrible things, we just blocked them because we're not going to argue with a young kid. Right. So you can say whatever you want to say because uh, we are, you know what, because we're blocking people and we don't, you know, we don't have nothing to say back and this and that. That isn't the truth. We're just over it. We're not going to argue with young kids. We're done with the drama. That's not what this YouTube channel is about. We want to have fun and make friends. And that's what we were doing before Steve Billings got all butt hurt about being a fame rider. And he couldn't handle the truth when we called him out on it. But, but it, we didn't call him out on it. But, but anyways, thought, but we, anyways we addressed it. We talked about it. We're done speaking about it. If you even bring it to our Twitter account, for any of you trolls, because I know some of you will be watching this video... You've already gave it a, a thumbs down already. You've probably already reported the video. If you're going to come at our channel and being hateful or saying anything remotely about the situation, we're just going to block you and remove you from our Twitter, from our YouTube, and we don't care. It is what it is. We said what we said. Now, hopefully, me and Mrs. Chubbs can get back on track and take care of us and not have to worry about you trolls anymore or you hateful people. So, um... I will she's have screenshots gonna, at the end of this, so you'll see all the screenshots that I have. She's going to try to vlog tomorrow, I guess, while I'm at work. And, um, yeah, that's it. So we got, we got some ham sandwiches to be eaten, so... Yeah, I got a bunch of food in my fridge that's leftovers, and I'm going to eat and it all I like got, he, he eats the ham sandwiches out of my fat rolls, so... Mm -hmm. And I'm ready to get a couple more chins, so... Yeah. See you guys. But anyways, it's game over, and, uh, we'll see you when we see you. Bye. Stupid, we had to make this video.